Hi guys, I'm Yes Renault. I'm from Wisconsin and Ohio. I go to school at Harvard University and I've been in Los Angeles for the last eight weeks to study film production. Eight weeks? Wow, you must have learned a lot. And I learned so much. Uh, so without further ado, I'm gonna share my list of things that I've learned in Los Angeles with you. Enjoy! Number one, the buses here will not pay back money on your fare. So if you put in $2 when it only costs you $1.50, uh, you will not get your change back. Man, if I had 50 cents for every time that happened to me, I would have my 50 cents back. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, you don't fool me twice. Numero dos. It never rains in California. I am still blown away by the fact that every day by about noontime, there are beautifully blue skies. Every day. That's not real. One time I walked out of my apartment and I saw the ground and it was completely wet and I thought, well you know, that had to happen one of these days, it had to rain. Two seconds later I started walking and I see this man with a hose and I put it together. It hasn't been raining, he's just cleaning the street. Like, <laughs> how do you not go crazy with all the happiness? Number three, if you go on a juice or smoothie diet, you are gonna miss food so badly by halfway through the first day. And if you're like me, you're gonna give up by the end of the day. You go to Los Angeles and you think, I'm gonna do a Dr. Oz smoothie diet. And then you're like, ah, ha, 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 ha. I miss bacon. Number four. The cost for one ticket at Disneyland is $96. So I guess, you know, if you wish upon a star and, you know, fork up all the cash in your wallet, you can make your dreams come true. <laughs> I'm not bitter, I'm just sad. Moral of the story, I didn't go to Disneyland. Number five, there are enough celebrities for everyone. Seems like everybody here works in the industry and knows someone who did something, who was in that movie that one time. Yeah, seriously, if you want a celebrity friend, just come to Los Angeles. I guarantee you'll find one, two months or less. They breed them like bunnies over here. Number six. California drivers are crazy drivers. Now I'm not sure if this is just because California drivers are aggressive drivers or because California is a conglomerate of a whole lot of different people from different states. Whatever the case, when you're merging lanes, do not put your blinker on. And that's because if somebody sees you put your blinker on, instead of doing the same thing, slowing down and thinking, I should let this person in, you know, because safety first, they will speed up to cut you off. So to be on the safe side, <laughs> don't use your blinker. Woo! Number seven. So I learned that the age to bartend in California is 21 and over. Now I know you guys are being like, well, duh, yes or no, like, you have to be 21 to drink, you have to be 21 to serve. But no, that is not true, because I have bartended in Massachusetts for the last year, where the age to serve there is 18 or older. So when I came to California, I thought I was gonna bartend as a side gig and make a little cha-chang, cha-chang, you know? And then I was sorely disappointed. So I'm not saying that we should have uniform laws across all states, but I'm just saying, if I can serve for my country at 18, then I should be able to serve alcohol to my country at 18. America. Okay, I'm gonna end it here. <laughs> um, one thing I have not yet learned is what an In-N-Out burger tastes like. Blasphemy. I know! So after this video is over, I am going to In-N-Out and I am gonna eat a burger, even though I don't really like burgers, but I'm gonna do it for the experience. Do it for the vine. <laughs> And then I'm gonna go run on a treadmill for five hours and feel bad about myself afterwards, but it'll be worth it! I'm Yes Reno, and everybody should come to Los Angeles at least once in their life. Thank you for watching, and if you like, subscribe down below or give this a little thumbs up!